Good morning. I'm Tom Solomon with 350.org. And before the Regents today is a topic from the UNM Foundation on Responsible Investing. By recommending not to divest from fossil fuel stocks, they've chosen the irresponsible path. The Foundation's investment in companies driving the planet towards climate disaster is immoral and irresponsible and puts them in collusion with those who are robbing UNM's own students of a livable future. I've now shared with many of the regions the ominous warnings from the world's best climate scientists, predictions that say that we are loading CO2 into the atmosphere so rapidly that within 19 years we will have burned through humanity's entire remaining carbon budget, locking in what every government in the world says is two degrees C of dangerous warming, with worse to come. This is the course set by our addiction to oil. But there is a better future within our grasp. We know what must be done to preserve a safe climate and the solutions here today are clean, feasible, and economical. We must instead use these next 19 years to install renewable energy on a huge scale. This means massive investments in wind, solar, and geothermal, and a smart grid. That means that plus making our buildings more efficient and converting to electric vehicles will allow us to transition away from fossil fuels and keep 80% of that dangerous carbon in the ground. And though we've started on this path, we need to be moving 100 times faster. And we could be, except for the obstruction of the oil, coal, and gas companies that spend $160 million a year lobbying to prevent Congress from taking these steps, and another $80 million a year denying climate change all to convince some that this can't be done, or that it's a made-up problem, and that all the world's climate scientists, plus the Pentagon and NASA, and every major scientific institution are somehow dreaming or in cahoots. The Foundation claims that the danger of global warming is just another cause, some special interest to be appeased or ignored. But what the fossil fuel companies are engaged in is nothing less than the willful destruction of God's creation the only known ecosystem in the universe that supports human life. And everyone who sees the second half of this century will suffer the consequences, including my children and yours. So yes, that's a cause, in the same way that World War II was a cause, because global warming presents a far worse threat to all of human civilization. But maybe you don't believe me. Well, that's fine. But then please, as regents, Call on your own science faculty to come and testify about the dangers we face and table this recommendation until you do. Because this is not just a financial decision, it carries an enormous moral weight as well. In 1941, when our country was attacked at Pearl Harbor, our parents saw an imminent threat and millions signed up to fight. While at home, we rapidly converted our economy to a war footing. They didn't wait to see what others would do, they didn't quibble over the costs, and they didn't hesitate saying that their own service by itself was insufficient to win the war. No, they stepped up to serve because they knew that everyone must do their part to win. And that concluded every single thing that they could do to help, from buying bonds, to donating scrap metal, to rationing food and sending their children to fight. Divestment is an important step that UNM can take to help, joining the 28 other universities that have already seen the light. All the arguments against it will not wash, when your children ask where all the forests went and why New Mexico looks like the Chihuahuan Desert. So please, honor UNM's commitment to sustainability and to science, and honor your role as the caretaker of your students' future. Don't put UNM on the wrong side of history. Thank you. Thank you, Tom. I'll let you go in next minute. You're on the roll. Yay! Next one. Jim McKinsey. We recommend and express our conviction that the sound investment strategies in place for the CIF should not be altered or modified in support of causes unrelated to these objectives. We respect the values of our diverse donors who may approach UNM Foundation with the desire to support the important works of UNM with an interest in having their gifts invested in a cause-related way. We will review individual requests, if and when they are received, to see if an appropriate endowment investment vehicle outside the CIF can be identified to meet the donor's concern. Uh, I, I 
think we've heard this quite rightly, and I would move approval. Second. Any other discussion? I'd like to have some material along those lines. I did some further research on what other schools are doing, which is consistent with uh, what uh, uh, Regent Cook's motion is. And I'd like to just read off the universities uh, that have followed similar approaches to this university. University of Wisconsin, California Public Employees Retirement Systems, California, and that's it. So I mean, this, this is something that I think is consistent um, with other universities and, and uh, result uh, I support that. Right. I made a motion and a second. Any other discussion? Aye. Opposed? Abstain. Aye, yeah, abstain. All right. Thank you.